Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here, coming at you again with another video, and I am here to show you, as you saw in the little description, how do you find organic polymer in the new map Genesis. Now there are lots of ways to do it. No, there's not. That's totally not true at all. The only way that I have found to find it so far is over, well I guess there are other ways, but the easiest way in my opinion is to go ahead and take yourself a Bloodstalker and uh, swing around the biome that you can find, and I'll just show you the chords where I am currently, 34.0, 44.1, and basically, I kind of force tamed a little area right here. If you kill a Hesperornis, does not matter the level, and uh, it can kind of just, you know, I'll go kill a couple of wild ones too, just so you can see. But when you harvest a Hesperornis, oh, can I not? There it goes, okay. I was very confused for a second there. So, when you kill a harvest, I guess, when you harvest these guys with a chainsaw, where did they even go? Uh, it's invisible now? Oh, there we go. They provide you with a decent amount of organic polymer. Now, if you're on, this is on official rates, so this is just a one times. You could be earning a lot more than this, um, but it's entirely up to you how you go about doing it. But if you need some quick organic polymer, this is not a long term thing, by the way. This is not something that I would plan on using, you know, in the long run because, well, unless you're on a boosted server, this is not feasible. If you are on a boosted server, like an MTS, a anything along those lines, it's actually really beneficial to come out here and kill these guys because you do get quite a bit when you boost up the stats. You can see here's a wild one right here, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and just, you know, execute this guy. Yes, I see that you're... Um, hello? There we go. So 12 per on an official server is not terrible. And just to show you that they exist around this zone, um, I'll kind of go ahead and show you with a tech transmitter. This guy right here, we'll go ahead and dino scan him. And Hesperornis, just so you can see, there are an absolute crap load. They are all over the place in this zone. You can uh, basically pick them and kill them. And you can come back if you really are dedicated with a load of organic poly because it's a very big problem on this map because you have to either have one making the hard poly or two you have to have a Ooh, there's another Hesperonis. now they can be hard to find without a bloodstalker because they kind of blend in as you see right here and uh that's you know that's that come here yes you come here i want you to come this way so i can actually execute you and take a picture of it see ya all right and just to show you one last time that, my friends, is how you get yourself a hold of some organic poly. It's, you know, it's a good small term thing, um, but the Bloodstalker actually moves pretty well. And um, especially if you activate the float mode, which is very useful, obviously. You can kind of like move between these little islands pretty easily. And uh, you just scan because he has that ability to see things, which is very nice. So it'll highlight pretty much everything here that is of any importance. I'm looking for another Hesperonis, but I don't see one. But if you just go around these uh, little islands, you will find some stuff. It's just a matter of time and how long it actually takes for you. So anyways, hope this video helps you out. If you don't mind leaving a like and subscribe in the link below, I guess check out the link below for my server. And uh, other than that, teach out.